Wake up. It's time to kickstart your day with Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration. Daily Dose of Inspiration. Good morning and welcome to this brand new day. This is Scripture Link's Daily Dose of Inspiration for Monday, October 3rd, 2016. And as you wake up and you start this brand new day, thank God for this day. Commit this day to Him. Use this day to bring glory and honor to our Lord. Use this day to share your faith with someone and encourage somebody. And while you're at it, give God praise today. He is worthy of our praise. He is worthy of our worship. He is worthy of all of our thanksgiving. Our scripture reading today is taken from the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse number 17. Scripture says, Therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. Friends, Paul's teaching this church at Corinth an important principle, one that we need to understand, is that when we are in Christ, when we, for lack of a better phrase, when we become Christians, when we accept Jesus as our Lord and Savior, we become a new creature. Old things, our old sinful habits, our old sinful ways, our old way of thinking, our own old way of doing life, all that has passed away. It was nailed with Jesus on the cross. And he says here, we become a new creature all things become new. We start following after Jesus. We start taking and doing the things he's called us to do. We start reading the Bible. We start applying its principles. Friends, if you've given your life to Christ and you're still living the same life, <clears throat> excuse me, the same life that you've lived before, then you need to reevaluate your relationship because you're not fulfilling what God wants you to do. He says, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. Friends, are you chasing after Jesus today? Have you forsook those things that are behind? Have you took off the old man? We're going to talk a little bit about that this week. If you took off the old man and put on the new man, we're going to see what that means this week. But for now, I want you to focus on the thought and on the question, is my life different now? than it was before I accepted Jesus. Only you can answer that. Think about that as you go through this day. And remember, get into God's Word and allow God's Word to get into you. Then share that Word with someone today. Have a blessed day. Thanks for listening. Check out our website, www.myscripturelinks.com.